Hello, hello, Sagittarius. This is Starbright. I'm here to do a reading for August the 28th to the end of this month. This is not going to resonate with everyone, so don't get mad if this is not your story. This is going to be for the sun, the moon, rise, Venus, and Jupiter in Sagittarius. Spirit of the earth, water, fire, and air. Show me the cards I really need to see and speak for Saggy. What does Sagittarius need to know? This time. Ten of Cups. Mm, somebody want a happy family, happy life with you. Somebody want a, a family business with you, a happy home life, domestic security. Mm. All right. Tell me more. And we have two of Cups. Soulmate. Some of you guys going to meet a new soulmate. Somebody want them. Some of you guys are uh, work, trying to do some kind of work balance, a union of assets, beneficial connection. Yeah, some of you guys have a soulmate coming in. Or you're already dealing with a soulmate. All right, what else is Sagittarius? Mmm, Knight of Pentacles. Some of you guys are dedicated, hardworking. Some of the people see you as a valuable asset to the company. All right, what else for Sagittarius? Mm, eight of Cups. Some of you guys will be walking away, branching out, moving onward, bigger and better things. Mm. Let's see what's going on here. Tell me more about this Ten of Cups. Tell me more about this Ten of Cups. Family, business, happy home life, domestic security. Why this card is here for Sagittarius? Why this card is here? Oh, somebody wants to propose to you. Y'all love offer coming in. This person sees the future with you. This is the one that's making some kind of decision, or you have to, or you making some kind of decision about this. This person living a distant, or this is the one that wants things to move fast. This person wanna work on this with you. This person could be pregnant, or this is a baby and mother, or this person wanna have your child. Yep, this person want an opportunity with you. This, mm, this person could be pregnant. This is someone that wants some kind of partnership with you. The person want to talk to you about this. This is the one to see that you're their wish. Yeah, this person wants an equal give and take with you. Yep, person want to be in the family with you. We got two cards saying ten of, ten of cups. Got the ten of cups here and the ten of cups. Somebody want to be in the family with you. Wants an equal give and take with you. All right. Two of cups. Work balance. Union of assets. Beneficial connection. This is a soulmate connection. Two of cups. Tell me more about this two of cups for Sagittarius. Mm, this is something that you've been manifesting into your life. Meet a new soulmate or you're dealing with a soulmate right now. This is something that could be stressing you out. Another soulmate card is here. Some of you guys been manifesting to meet a new soulmate or dealing with a soulmate now. You could have had a fight with this person or you stressing out because you know this person is your soulmate. You want this opportunity, or this person want an opportunity with you. You're about to get your wish. But you really don't know how this person feel about you, or this person don't know how you feel about them. Tell me more, Spirit. This is the one that you feel like you have to protect yourself from this person. You're making some kind of decision. You're not. It's not easy for you to make this decision because this person lives at a distance, or this person is moving too fast for you. Yeah, this is one that wants to commit to you. Could be a boss, an Aries, or someone that have their own business. You're about to receive an unexpected message from, from someone. About to receive an unexpected message from someone, feeling defeated. This is one could be sad that they miss this opportunity with you. This is one could be obsessed with you or mad or angry or jealous of you right now. 
This person could be stressed out. The money could be going in, the money could be going out. Ever since the person could have left you or closed out a cycle with you. This is one that could have ghosted you and your luck had changed. Hmm. All right. Some of you guys who are dealing with Aries, Little Sag, Virgo, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, a Capricorn, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Scorpio, Aquarius, Younger, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, and Aries, uh, Leo, Virgo, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, Sag, Sagittarius, Scorpio, Libra, and Aquarius, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, a Cancer, Leo, Gemini. All right. Knight of Pentacles. Dedicated, hardworking, valuable assets. People see you that way. People see you that dedicated, hardworking. Tell me more about this Knight of Pentacles. Hmm. Or well, some of you guys might meet this Knight, the Knight of Pentacles, while traveling. That you're trying to you met someone watch family you try to make some kind of decision about this person you see this person as someone loving and caring and giving but you keep looking back at something that could have happened in the past you don't trust this person You don't trust this person because you could be could because you are this king of pentacles or you this person could be a king of pentacles this is the one in your uh, your this is the one you was in a family with this person. You don't trust this person because of someone you were dealing with. Could have been a king of pentacles. This is someone that you could have been in your family. You feel like your luck had changed when you end things with this person. Some of you guys were feeling very burned and burnt out. You feel like someone tried to manipulate you, or you're gonna feel like this person tried to manipulate you. This is something that's going to stress you out. This is someone that's ready to commit to you. This is one take their time to commit to you. Yeah, this is one that wants to talk to you, but you're sad right now because of someone could have took a break from you and you're trying to heal from this person. You try not to show this person any emotions. You feel like you need to protect yourself from this person. This person could be younger than you or you younger than this person or this is one to have a child or you have a child. Mm. All right. All right. Eight of Cups. Why this card is here? Eight of Cups. Why this card is here for Sagittarius? Eight of Cups. Why this card is here for Sagittarius? Some of you guys could be walking away from someone. So you can have victory. Or someone walked away from you because of someone else they wanted victory with. Now this person could be sick, have a health problem, full of guilt. This is what could be sad, could be drinking because they took this action or they could have got pregnant by someone that's in and out of their life. This is the one that you have to make some kind of decision about this person. It's not going to be easy to make this decision. This could be a new person or this is an ex. This is one that ghosts you because they were still holding on to someone else. Now this person want to come back and apologize to you. This is one could be feeling defeated right now. Sad that they missed this opportunity with you. This one to see you as a soulmate. And now this person wants this opportunity with you. Person ready to commit to you and talk to you. This is one that could have been sad ever since they took a break from you. Because of someone from their past. This person been watching you. The person been stalking, gathering information about you. Is this King of Coins? This is the one that wants a family with you, or you could be in a family with this person. This person could have lied to you, stole from you, betrayed you because of someone else they was thinking about. This person want to be honest with you. Why they left you out in the cold so they can start dating someone else they saw a future with. They wanted to move forward with this person. They could have met that person at work. Their family, friends, and co-workers are out and about. Now this person wants a partnership with you. Wants an equal give and take with you. This person could be mad and angry and jealous of you right now. Because of someone else could have broke their heart. Oh, this person could be mad and angry with someone that broke their heart. 
and it has some kind of resentment toward this person. Yeah. This is someone that's coming back to a fight for the relationship with you. The person is very attracted to you. Some of you guys are going to listen to what this person has to say. Is this person going to say the right thing? Some of you guys are just going to cut this person out of your life. Because you're going to feel like this person is still hiding things from you. Yeah, some of you guys might walk away from this person. Or you feel like this person is hiding someone from you. And that's just all that this person will walk away from you again. And try to juggle you with someone else. Some of you guys just wanted to be single right now. Hmm. Spirit. What is the overall energy for this reading for today? What is the overall energy? What's the overall energy for this reading for Sagittarius? What is the overall energy for this reading for Sagittarius? Hmm. Somebody ready to commit to you. Ooh. You could be married to this person or a person want to marry you. Some of you guys might be indecisive about this person. But this is one that you see this person as your twin flame. And you see this person as your soulmate. This is the one that sees you as someone doing pretty good for yourself. The person very attracted to you. But you feel like this person will cut you out of their, out of your life, out of their life, and have your relationship on hold. You feel like this person will leave you, close out a cycle with you, so they can move to common waters with someone else they want a reunion with. Yeah. All right, you guys. If you're new to my channel, hey, hit that like button. Hit that notification you know when I'm on. If you need a personal reading from me, all the information is down below in the description box. Until next time, you guys. Bye-bye.